Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're doing great and fabulous on this beautiful day. Today I'm going to be showing you how to transform a men's oversized t-shirt into a beautiful bell sleeved crop top. I am so in love with this color. It's this beautiful dusty pink color and I got this t-shirt for about $6 from Mr. Price and I am so in love with how it turned out and it's super easy to do. So let's get right into it. First off, I started by marking off 10 inches from the bottom of the t-shirt. Now you can do a bit longer if you want the top to fall a bit longer, if that makes sense. So in case you want more than 10 inches, go right ahead and mark where you want the length of your top to reach. And I just did this all across, that way I could cut a straight line. After I'd marked off my points, I just joined them together using a ruler and then I cut off that bit using a pair of scissors, obviously. So once I chopped off the bottom half, I moved on to the top and I just got rid of the collar. I thought it looked a bit weird and I didn't want it. And you definitely, you can leave it in, but I think it would make the top look a bit weird. But I decided to get rid of it. Out the door, she was out the door. Once your collar is off, I don't know if this is a collar, but you can see what I'm talking about. Once that was off, I marked the midpoint of my shirt and drew a straight line down my shirt. I wanted to find the midpoint, that way I could have two even pieces. And as you can see, I'm just cutting my t-shirt into two. And this will be your sleeve. So one sleeve on one side and the other, as you're about to see. And I just took this bit. As you can see, there's already some form of casing on the t-shirt arm so what I did is I measured elastic around my arm and since this elastic was so much thicker than the thickness of my casing which came with the shirt I decided to cut my elastic into half that way I'd have bits that would pass through my t-shirt comfortably Sized elastic and all I did is I poked a hole on the inside of the casing I pinned one side of the elastic to the t-shirt with a safety pin and then I put a safety pin on the other end that way I could pass my elastic through my t-shirt you've seen me do this a million times and I think elastic is your best friend I love working with elastic in my DIY projects if you've watched my videos you know that but all I did was I just passed it through my casing and quote unquote because it's a makeshift casing and I pulled it through make sure you shush it out that way it's even and it actually fits your arm once you try the t-shirt on and once it's nice and snug just take out the safety pins and sew to join the two ends together That's what your sleeves should look like at this point. Now we're going to move on to the top bit of the shirt and what I did is I measured across my chest. Same procedure, just poke a hole in the makeshift casing and then pass your elastic through. And once you've done that, that's it. Basically what we're doing is we're passing the elastic through all the hems of the t-shirt and I thought this was very easy to do. You don't need to create a new hem to pass the elastic through. Once you've passed your elastic through, just shush it out. Obviously, you want it to fit your body 
and just make sure she's nice and snug and all up in there and once you've done that just like before join the two ends together that way your elastic is okay and I just left my elastic like that basically this is what your top looks like at this point and now I'm just going to join the sleeves to the top bit and as you can see you can see a bit of the elastic but once you sew it it's going to be on the inside anyway and no one's gonna see it so I didn't bother hiding the elastic but you can if you'd like it's all up to you once you've attached the sleeves just sew so that they're nice and tight to the top and that's it you have your beautiful bell sleeved crop top I am so in love with this top mostly because of the color I think it's such a flattering and beautiful color anyway that's all I have for you guys today thank you so much for watching let me know if you'll be trying this DIY for yourself I highly recommend it because I think it's awesome not to toot my own horn or anything <laughs> but yeah anyway hopefully I catch you in my next video